Um, you know, just starting off with today, uh, I thought today was a, a good work day, you know, a little bit shortened, you know, with the bye week. Uh, you know, wanted to come out, wanted to get, you know, good on good, you know, speed work, uh, you know, offense, defense. Uh, got some good work in special teams, you know, you know, big emphasis on on uh, fundamentals, you know, trying to trying to continue to prove on the consistency of our execution. Uh, you know, I think you've, you've seen you know, through the first seven games of the year that there, you know, there's been a, a, a lot of growth. There's been a, you know, uh, you know, we've got you know, really close in, in, in the things that we're doing. We've seen it, you know, at, at a very high level, and then we've seen it just you know, with some inconsistencies that ultimately, uh, you know, uh, allowed us to come up short in a, in a few contests. And so, uh, you know, as we get into this week, I mean, this is a work week, and you know, we had, we had good meetings this morning. You know, we met Sunday. Um, you know, recapped, you know, everything from the game. And, and then, uh, you know, I really have liked the guys' approach. You know, they got lifted well. Um, you know, coming out today, I thought it was, uh, you know, a, a beneficial beneficial work day. Still getting some extra uh, work with some of the young guys that, um, you know, that are, are growing and developing through this year. Uh, and I, I think there's you know, a lot of positives that, that come out of uh, come out of that. Uh, you know, it was good seeing some guys, you know, getting more, more that have been banged up, getting more reps and trying to, to push along in their uh, – in their rehab, and uh, so I mean, all those things are, are important for this week. Is, is the margin of error in this conference so so thin that losing your focus in one or two periods of practice does not help you show up on Saturday? Yeah, I mean, it's you know, it's it's practice, it's preparation, it's uh, you know, in the course of the game, you know, it's a uh, um, a lot of things that are that are there to distract you, and you know. A play can be distracting. A result, you know, uh, you know an opponent, you know, uh, you know, obviously you know, schemes, movements, atmosphere. There's plenty of things that can that can try to take your attention for you know the importance of, of that one play or that one uh, a situation um, and, and what it's what's being called upon you. And you know that's one of the reasons we try to to do what we do in 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 practice and some of the, the, the things that we, we hold a standard to, to how we want to operate and you know to, to try to, to emphasize the importance of the details and um, you know, I've never seen a perfect game I've never seen you know a, a perfect player um, you know but but ultimately you want you want guys to when it's all focused you know as, as you know as much discipline as we can put into it and then you know being accountable to the job that we have and you know, that's something that we, we strive for and we push for. Uh, you know, each day, but uh, you know when you have those examples that you that you can pull. And you know, I mean, you look through the last three games. I mean, I, you know, it's it's been you know just a, the the way things have kind of stacked on at inopportune inopportune times. Um, you know, it's you know, I think there's times where we where we've pressed times that you know guys you know if a bad play happens we try to do almost too much and you know whether it's you know not fit a gap that you're supposed to be in or maybe not not do you know have your eyes exactly where they need to be or or you know just the uh, um, you know the focus of finishing a play and uh, when you get an opportunity it's just you know there's a there's a there's a lot of those things that have kind of you know, you know stacked up in inopportune moments um, you know our guys have done a nice job in in their response throughout it but you know it's just you know you see it you see at the end just how big those plays are and uh, how big those moments are, especially against good teams. I mean, you know, there's there's times you can get away with a, you know, with a mistake here, a mistake there. But I mean, that's you know, you look at the last three opponents we played, and you know they have they've done a good job of not beating themselves. And there's that's you know we've had we've had stretches whether you know the last game. I mean, you take a minute and fifty seconds of of the end of the first half, beginning of the second half. Uh, you know, some uncharacteristic you know things that show up, and man, it just it, it jumps on you. It's twenty point, twenty point swing in that in that period of time. And um, you know, our guys, you know, they yes, they continue to fight. Yes, so we, we had opportunities, but you know, it's just you know, every snap is the snap, and it was the exact message leaving the locker room before that game. It's just hey, one play at a time. Focus on the one play because it is the most important. Um, but then games happen, life happens, you know. And uh, like I said, there's. There's, there's all good intentions within this team. I mean, we got guys that really care, that really work. Um, you know, we just have to be continue to build upon our consistency in those moments. Going back and watching the, going back and watching the film, what do you see about just the run game? How well it was blocked and executed, and how can that be something to build on? Kind of going into the final five games. Uh, I, mean, I thought I thought guys did a good job. I mean, it was um, we knew there would be challenges and and in, uh, in, in what we were facing, but you know, guys embraced the challenge and they they did a. Uh, 
good job of you know taking you know taking what they were you know, um, what they were giving us. Uh, you know, trying to keep them off balance. Uh, you know, we were able to create some seams. You know, we were able to hit some uh, you know, hit some runs, and you know, I, I think that um, you know, guys executed a, executed a plan really well when it came to, came to the run game. And we still had some missed, some missed opportunities that uh, uh, that showed up. But I mean, it was I mean it was a it was a real battle, and uh, I thought our guys battled at a high level. And uh, you know, it's, it's a testament to, to the development of what those guys are doing up front you know obviously uh, backs quarterbacks receivers everybody's involved when it comes to running the football so uh, I thought they all did a nice job. Yeah I mean it's, at times I mean there's you know, we gave up a couple of explosive plays that you know it was they weren't it wasn't it was something that was out of the uh, Uncharacteristic of what we've done, and we got really good players that have that have been that have played at a consistent level. But you know, whenever whenever there is a negative, and you know, turning the ball over is a negative thing, right? You know, giving up a our kickoff or coverage unit has been my favorite unit on this team, and you know, we had an opportunity to get get the guy down. He sparks me, he, he squirts out, and it's a what a 70 yard kickoff return. That's a that's a negative. Um, and in those times and in those moments, you know, you gotta. You just got to go out there and play the next play. Trust, trust the things that are there. And um, you know, we gave up you know, you know, two explosives pretty, pretty quickly after those negatives that that are uncharacteristic, uh, uncharacteristic. And um, you know, it's just nobody wants to. Nobody. But then you you go back and you see the film, and it's just the it's the importance of that in those situations. Um, because you know, I, I'll say one thing that I was was proud of. You know, we you know obviously through that course of time. Uh, you know, we had the, we had the three and out. Um, you know they're coming coming right after that uh, with the defense, or you know uh, where we ended up going for the fake punt, and you know we come up a yard short on that, and the um, you know, defense was put in another tough situation, and you know there to be able to hold hold them to a field goal that was that was a a nobody wants to give up a field goal, but I mean that was a good response in a bad situation, and I was proud of our guys. Um, you know, even in that moment, and then you know we were able to get get things going there after that. But uh, you know, it's you know, t tough situations are going to show up in a game. I mean, you know, especially when you're playing good teams, guys will make plays. Guys, you know, there's you have to give credit to them and what and what they did and, and how they you know how they played. But um, you know, as long as we'll as long as we'll control what we can control, I mean, I, I've got a lot of confidence in how this team um, you, know, you know can and will play as as we continue to grow. You know, you get um, a little bit of the back this week practicing, and um, Winston seemed to do more stuff. Um, how are they looking? You know, what do you see out of them? No, it's good. I mean, you know, Fabian really tried. I mean, it was very limited in, in practice um, all the way till Friday, and they, you know, he went tried to get some work Friday, but he wasn't. He wasn't going to be ready. It wouldn't be fair to him or, or to you know to what we're you know what we're trying to do. Um, so he so obviously we held him out uh, you know there uh, uh, Saturday, and then you know we knew that this week we try to get him a little bit more individual and then ramp it up you know, as, as we go to next week. But uh, you know I'm excited about you know just just his work, his leadership. You know he's a such a key you know member to this defense and to this football team for for who he is, how he plays, and uh, you know it's been hard with him you know being out. You know guys have stepped up, and you've seen some. Uh, you know some good production uh, from, from from some younger guys, or, but uh, you know not having him, not having JJ, it really you know, we were we were uh, a little thin in there. You know, moved Dennis Briggs there inside, and I thought he did a, a, a good job. Um, you know Dennis played there majority of the, of the time last year, and you know kind of had that flexibility with what we've seen from Pat Payton, and some of those young young uh, ends, how Leonard's playing out there, uh, it's kind of giving us some flexibility as well. So uh, you know it's good seeing them. You know Winston is continuing on on his. Uh, you know, on his process getting back and you know there's still some things that, that he's working on but you see him doing more uh you know with each week that goes by and uh you know just you know, his his heart and the determination is it's really special are those passes to johnny in the end zone the lob kind of passes is there something you'd rather see jordan do with the throw like maybe higher or... uh, those are things that we work we work in practice and uh you know, you know obviously we've been we've been pretty good you know at it this year i mean there's some things that uh uh, you know, that I like to do better, uh, you know, just in, in, in situational uh, uh, parts of it. But uh, you know, those guys are—they've they, done a really good job at it. And you know, on that, on that, on those, on those opportunities, we you know, we weren't we weren't as, as good as we needed to be. But uh, yeah, we'll we'll continue to, to work at that. So the turnovers are coming defensively. Do you guys have to look at if you're doing enough to force them, or do you just, is it just kind of coming? No, it's a it's a combination. I mean, in this, you know. We've got to create takeaways. That's something that, and that's, 
I mean, that's sometimes it's violent collision. Sometimes it's, you know, just getting the ball on the ground, you know, but we have had, we've, we've made some explosive plays defensively. And that's where, you know, it's a kind of a twofold, you know, you got to give credit to, to the opponent when you're, when you're putting pressure on somebody, when you're, you're, when you're able to get, you know, get to them, um, you know, either, they're doing a good job of not putting the ball in jeopardy, but on the flip side of it, we, we, we've got to be able to create those. And so, uh, you know, it's a, you know, we've had some opportunities. I think there's been some times that, um, you know, we absolutely can be better in, in helping force, you know, some of that, that unrest, but, um, you know, it's, it's something we all take ownership in and whether it's coaches, pl players, I mean, there's, there are opportunities and we got to, we got to create more of those opportunities and, and, you know, be able to create those explosive plays. Last one for them for that balance, you know, like to, you want to create turnovers, but you also want to, don't be too aggressive to give up that big play. So how do you strike that balance? I mean, it's I mean, I want guys to be aggressive. I mean, you, I think you can be both. I mean, ultimately, you know, I've got confidence in the guys that that I coach, and and uh, you know, you can be aggressive and, and still do your job and not giving up, you know, not giving up, you know, the ver the vertical play. And uh, you know, as we as we continue to uh, to hit those the, the fundamentals and the execution of, of those assignments. Um, you know, like we had a we had a, we gave up an explosive play at the beginning of the game where you know we have we have an opportunity. Um, you know, we don't we don't communicate something that we worked pretty good a pretty good amount and in the game and you know, we give up a a guy running you know running free that sh should not happen and that's not you know you know that's a you, know, you can be aggressive and still limit you know the, the the explosive plays and our guys have done a great job of not giving up explosive plays throughout the year um, but you know obviously that uh, we gotta we gotta carry that over and be you know control the things that we can control to make sure that those don't uh, that those don't occur